please stand for a moment of silence, followed by the pledge. And now the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back to this October 7th edition of the Daily Growl. I'm Ben. And I'm Layla. Happy World Habitat Day with the latest devastation in the panhandle flooding handle Having a place to reside is super important. If you donate today to the American Red Cross as they assist the major disasters. On this day in 1982, the musical Cats opened on Broadway. Haven't you haven't seen it? You should. Speaking of songs we're familiar with, the weather today will be scattered thunderstorms with a high of 86 and a low of 73, with a 40% chance of rain. Rain seems to be. Rain seems like it just won't go away. Stay dry, my friends. We'd like to wish a happy birthday today to Lee John Edwards, Jay Lee Hardenbrook, Alex Sergero Desev, and Mr. Height. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> we really hope you guys have a wonderful birthday today. Junior class t-shirts and hoodies are now on sale. Please see Ms. Han or Mr. Murphy in room 608 or your English teacher for your order forms. Don't be left out. The sale that ends on October 21st. All underclassmen, listen up. This Friday, due to testing, we will not be able to make all calls after first period until the end of testing. It is very important that you know when to send kids to have their pictures taken. Pictures will be taken in the gym lobby this year due to the media center being used for testing and lunches this school year. Students are to enter the gym from the outside like they are going to a volleyball or basketball game. Students should be aware of this so that you are not walking throughout the gym. This is also the day that teachers are to have their pictures taken for the yearbook. Teachers, don't forget, Friday is picture day. A schedule will be posted on Daily Growl TV social media for those who forget. The library still has a lot of books that were checked out last year if you haven't been returned. If you have a library book from last year or any other year, please return it to the library as soon as possible. There will be no overdue fines charged. If you ever miss the news, you can watch us by clicking on the link in our bio on Instagram at Daily Growl TV. It's that easy. However, if you don't have Instagram, or if your teacher isn't playing the news, you can now visit the BCHS website to view the news. Exciting, we know. Starting at the home page, at the top, click for students, then click student help, student parent helpful links. That on the page you will see news and information, and there you go, daily growl for everyone. Having trouble with your math class or need extra time to finish assignments? The math department is providing a mathematics lab every Tuesday after school from 2.30 to 3.30 in room 529. Math teachers are there to help you with your work. The Junior Cookie Dough Fundraiser is in full swing. Cookie dough. If you would like to be on the prom committee, you must participate in the Cookie Dough Fundraiser. Cookie dough. Prom committee members and officers are required to sell at least 10 items. The prom committee is responsible for organizing all prom activities and will include a field trip to the chosen prom venue. Start selling your cookie dough today! Cookie dough. For more info, see Ms. Hand and, or Mr. Murphy. BCHS Wildcat Lanyards for only $10, Breast Cancer Awareness Hot Pink Socks for $20, Freshman Class T-shirts are on sale. See Ms. Regan or a Freshman Class Officer and order yours today. Today, FSA Reading Retakes Round 2. Thursday, it's FSA Round 3, for those who missed it, and JV hosts Oakleaf, which is a change from what we said previously, at Memorial Stadium. Friday, FSA Round 4 is happening. Cross Country heads to the Eagle Invitational, and it's underclassmen yearbook picks. Also, Varsity Football heads to Terry Parker, and the game is at 6. Look for ticket info on Daily Growl TV social media as we will keep you updated as soon as we get info. Remember, there is a limit on to how many tickets they will sell. Look for the link usually on Tuesdays for away games. CFC and FCA members, don't forget 
lunchtime Bible studies and Miss Helms during your lunch for those who've signed up. That's it for today. We hope you have a wonderful Wednesday, Wildcats. We'll see, we'll you, see tomorrow. you tomorrow.